Hello everyone and welcome to another release video from Altrady. And in this release, as you can already see, we've released a new dashboard. This dashboard will be your go-to area for when you want to have a quick overview of your accounts and bots. Up here you have a list of your open positions and you can quickly see which markets are open and how the P&L is performing. For the smart positions you can also close them quickly. You can also see your recently closed positions right here. At the bottom you will see the bots and see how they are performing over time and how they've been doing recently. At the top right here you can see your balance. This is a quick 30 day balance overview which allows you to quickly check your balance from the last few days. Below here we've got a quick getting started. Now for you that are already familiar with Altrady, we still encourage you to watch the videos. But for new people this will be a very quick and easy way to figure out how to get started with Altrady. And down here we have a list of the coins with the top market cap, with quick access to the market explorer. Another new thing that we've done is overhaul the bots area. So as you can see now the bot dashboard has also changed. And you can see all your bots that are running right here. The closed bots are right here. So now you don't have to go into a bot to quickly see how they are performing. We've also made some changes to the way that you can set up SignalBot. So if you go to the SignalBot, you now select your signal provider and you can just select your account. And the currency. And then the bot name will, will be automatically generated. Another thing that we've added to the bots is the cooldown after opening and cooldown after stop loss. This means that the bot will not take new positions once a new position has been opened. And you can set the time for how long. So for example, if I set it to one hour after a position is started, then no new positions will be created for one hour. And you can do the same for a stop loss. So once a position is closed by stop loss, your signal bot will not take any new positions for at least an hour. This is a great way to, to wait for the market to cool down a bit and then start fresh with a new position. We've also changed something for the way to set up grid bots. So if you go to the grid bot and you do backtest, you can select your market, you can set your highs and lows, you can set your number of orders, and you can set your size. And then you can select the fee that you pay, and then you do the backtest. After the backtest is completed and you want to continue with this setup, then you can just say use this setup. And you can select the account from here and then click on the account to start. So this is a quick way to set up a grid bot based on the backtesting feature. We've also made some changes to the paper trading function. So before, if you didn't have the funds, you would first have to buy it and then you could use it to set up your new position. But sometimes you just want to get into the market and you just want to test it out as if you had the funds. So right now you can just click on edit balance and give yourself a balance to trade with. And then you can quickly use the new balance to set up your orders. So that's it for this release video. Please let us know how you find the new dashboards for the overall dashboard and the signal bots and grid bots. And if you have other feature requests, as usual, you can always let us know. And then I wish you happy trading.